What is going on YouTube? My name is Andy Gabs. My name is Scarlet Storm. And Scarlet Storm, what are we doing today? Feeding our snake. We're feeding our snake. And what is our snake's name? Lemon. Lemon. Today, this is going to be a pretty short video, but Scarlet wanted to film a vlog of feeding our snake Lemon. And this is the first time that we're going to be feeding Lemon since we got him, right? Yeah, we had to wait a little while because I wanted Lemon to get nice and comfy. Sorry, my dog decided to grab a bone in the middle of my filming. Uh, but we're going to feed Lemon. But before we do that, I want to show you guys a couple things. I just got home from work and we are just kind of hanging out watching TV. We just finished having dinner. But I wanted to show you guys something, something that I didn't film. Regrettably, I probably should have um, because it was a really big project and it was really cool. But it was the first time that I had ever done anything like this. So I do it once, make sure I could do it. But once we actually, we might be moving soon uh, up to a different state. So once we move, I will make another video setting another one of these up. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So it's still got some haze. Uh, it's still not 100% clear because it hasn't been up for very long. I think it's only been up for like a week maybe. But this is a 60 gallon cube freshwater planted aquarium. All of this inside of there, that's all uh, mapani wood and live plants as you can see. There's some angelfish that are swimming around in there. I think I have, what, four angelfish in here. A few different colors. Got a blue, gray. Then we've got a bunch of little fancy guppies that keep having babies. Though I think the angelfish are eating a lot of the babies. Now, also in this tank, it's really hard to see, and it's really, I don't 100% know uh, where I left off. My camera battery died in the middle of filming that clip. Um, what I was saying is it's very hard to see, but there's three different species of shrimp that live in here too. Uh, cherry shrimp and two others. I really don't remember the name. I'm not gonna lie to you. They're everywhere and I see them every now and then. There's some pretty yellow ones, some red ones, some blue, some blacks. And then there's this bigger species. I'm just drawing blanks on their names. They get about two inches long. They're in here somewhere. I can just pretty much never see them. And uh, can you see the fish definitely want to get fed right now? They're all swimming right next to my head. Overall, this was a super fun build. I can't wait to make another one. Maybe saltwater. Now I know fish really aren't my thing, but if a saltwater tank build is something that you would want to see, smash that like button. Let me know uh, if this video gets how many likes, babe? Can you tell me how many likes on the video? I'm not gonna tell you. Just tell me how many likes. Okay, then a million. She said a million, which is just a little tiny bit unrealistic. Scarlett, how many likes to build a saltwater fish tank? 1778. She yeah. said 1778. So I'm gonna need 1778 likes, and we will build a 60 gallon cube fish tank just like this, but saltwater. Please ignore our messy house, but Scarlett, are you ready to go downstairs and introduce the world to Lemon? Yeah! And are you ready to go downstairs and feed Lemon? Yeah! Now, I asked you earlier, what does Lemon eat? Rats. Lemon eats rats. So does Daddy have a frozen thawed rat defrosting right now? Yeah. Is it gonna be pretty yummy? Yeah. You wanna take a bite? No. Okay, so only Lemon's gonna take a bite. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's go downstairs and feed Lemon for the first time. Yeah! Also, uh, this guy has been on the channel a couple times before, but it has been a good long while. This is my good boy Enzo. He is currently enjoying all of his toys. Here is our rat. It has been defrosting now for quite a while. Now it is admittedly kind of a big rat for the size of this Burmese python, but I think he'll have no problem. Um, we're about to go to Florida and on a cruise for 10 days. Now if you want to see videos from that, I would also appreciate it. Let me know in the comments if you want to see videos from our trip to Disney World. We're going to be at Epcot and Magic Kingdom. We're gonna go hang out with Robbie Kezzy from Swamp Brothers for a day, and then we're going on a cruise where we're going to the Bahamas, we're going to Honduras, and we're going to two ports in Mexico. So some really cool stuff can come. If you guys wanna see those, let me know in the comments below. Now, let's bring this rat downstairs and go feed our berm. Real quick, before we feed the snake, I wanna show you kind of the little setup we have going. This is a temporary setup. It's not gonna be in this for very long. As you know, Burmese pythons get quite big, so uh, I'm gonna have to build a cage or purchase like a vision cage or something like that to store it in. It gets cold down here, so it's nothing too fancy. We've got a visible heat light. There's a ceramic heater in that back one. Then a um, heating pad underneath here. This heating pad does not get very hot at all. And then it's just a uh, 40 gallon breeder. This is all he is in for now. Water bowl. There's his uh, little slate pad over there to get warm on. And there he is. 
just hanging out and ready for some food. So I've never filmed on a GoPro before, but my R6 Mark II just died. So this is the first time ever filming on my GoPro. I, I got this for our crew. So Scarlett, you can go ahead and come here. What I want you to do. Yeah. Yep, and you can watch this way. We are gonna feed the snake. Are you ready? Yes. I need you to stay back. You're gonna stay right there, okay? okay? I am really not sure how much of an aggressive eater this guy is. Like I said, this is honestly the first time that I've ever fed it. So I'm hoping that it doesn't launch out of the cage and bite me instead. Camera is still filming, screen turned off, didn't know what happened. Let's do this. I do have some big tongs, so hopefully I don't get slammed. Big rat, for size comparison, I have some pretty big hands. Uh, let's go ahead and see if he eats. Let's see if he wants to eat. You can definitely see him smelling it. Oh, here he goes, now he's interested. Gonna take it, I think. Scarlett, you watch in? Yeah. So what I'm gonna do now, since it doesn't seem like he wants to take it, carefully grab this so he doesn't bite me. And I'm just gonna take this rat, put it right there, close his cage. Got the rat sitting right there. He's definitely interested. I feel like if we leave it there for like 30 minutes, he'll come down and get it, but uh, we'll go ahead and come back down in a little while and give it a check. I hope that came out at least somewhat cool. Uh, I haven't watched it yet. I know he ate, which is a great sign. That's absolutely awesome. But I also know that the light turned off at some point while he was eating. I'm just not sure when. Now I know this was a super fast video, but like I said, my daughter told me she wanted to film a video of when we fed him his first meal. So can't say no to her, right? Figured I'd give her this little one. Uh, I'm assuming this video is only gonna be like five, six minutes long, but I do hope you guys enjoyed. I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe, turn that notification bell on so you get notified every time I post, hit the like button, drop me a comment down below. Let me know if you wanna see videos from Disney and our trip to the Bahamas, the islands, and Central America. Uh, maybe we'll even be able to find some reptiles, no guarantees there, but I think it would be pretty cool. I appreciate y'all and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.